3GIS has accelerated fiber deployments in communities of all sizes, making high-speed, low-latency network access available for emerging data applications. Our network solutions that use the 3GIS application and automation tools, along with our augmented design services team, have produced defensible network designs that met customer specifications in a fraction of the time of traditional CAD drawing methods. Here are some results we have delivered for customers on fiber network projects, both big and small. For a large 5G build-out in a northeastern U.S. market, 3GIS designed 2.6 million feet of network route with telecom features that reached 570 destination points, served 12 hubs, and passed 18,000 businesses. 3GIS completed this in five weeks, five times faster than the customer's requirements. On a smaller fiber to the home project, 3GIS designed more than 201,000 feet of network route that delivered service to more than 2,200 homes. This design was completed in just two days. So how does 3GIS add this kind of speed to the design process? Through the human in the loop, or what we call the HIDL process. Here's how it works. Once the business and engineers set the network rules, route data is entered in the prospector, 3GIS's automated network planning and design tool. Prospector generates a least cost route to the destination points. Those routes are verified by a network engineer and any necessary edits are made. Prospector uses the updated data to generate a network design with telecom features. Field crews verify the constructability of the routes and make any required edits. The design is approved by engineering and construction documents are ready to print. Using our HIDL process, 3GIS Network Solutions provides the automation and collaboration environment for faster network construction and the data needed by service providers to derive better economics from their outside plant investments. Let 3GIS Augmented Design Services save your organization time and money by accelerating its next fiber network project.